Uh, Brian Ortega. Um, what do you do with him in the meantime? I mean, do you have any idea of uh, getting him another fight? It sounds like maybe you tried to put something together this weekend. It didn't happen. Um, what, what's the next move for him? We're working on it. We're working on it. So, obviously, uh, literally, Jeremy Stevens will not stop blowing me up. He wants this fight so bad. He said he'll take it on short notice. He's cutting weight already and, and uh, with the hopes that, that Ortega will accept the fight. Ortega has turned down the fight. Um, so... I don't know. We'll see what happens. You know, with you fighting right before the heavyweight title fight that night, if maybe timing might work out, stars might align, and this could mean a, a special night for you, maybe a title shot in the future. Yeah! It really don't matter because, you know, I feel like, feel like we should have been getting paid pay-per-view points anyway. So everybody really buying the pay-per-view because of me and Francis. I'm really excited to get back in the autogone. You know, um, I lost my last fight against Stipe, and then it was a great f performance uh, for Stipe, but I, I learned a lot about that fight. I'm pretty sure that it, uh, um, the rematch will be different. I'll do better than I did the last time, and I will do great. I work at the fire department. I get, I get, I get my balls busted every day. You know what I mean? I'm, I'm a little guy on the, on, on the, on the department. Like I tell you, I always, they always give me a plunger, no matter after a fight, they're like, hey, go to town. I'm like, awesome, yay, get to work on the toilet, you know, and, or clean the floors or clean the trucks, you know, so, I'm, yeah, I'm not good. No one's going to get under my skin. Oh, my wife has that, knows that button to get under my skin. Why in the world, if things go well, would you go back down to 205? Like, what is there for you to do? I'm just, I'm honestly, like, really selfish, and I don't want to give up one of the belts. So it's, like, going to be a fight between Dane and I, but... I mean, we'll see what happens. I mean, either I fight at 205 or, I mean, I've already got a challenge in the back. Derek Lewis told me that he was going to knock me out right before we walked out of here. So, I mean, Derek Lewis may knock out Francis and then knock me out afterwards. I don't know. I know they got guys that are lined up to fight me. They've been, he's been sizing me up since I got back there and called me small. He's like, well, you're a lot smaller than everybody up here. That's rude, Derek. He said it. Like, wow, you're a lot smaller than everybody else. What? That's crazy. Oh, you are. Derek, what's your issue with Daniel? <laughs> I want to know too. He disrespected Popeye's chicken on a commercial for years ago. <laughs>